In order to get past me, you must answer th you must answer these three questions without fail. Are you ready? Which Pokemon of these three has the highest special attack stat? Vicavolt. Which Pokemon out of these three has the highest base special defense? It's either Florgis or Probopass. I'm gonna go Florgis. Nice. Final question. Who's stronger? Me or you? <laughs> Let's find out. Oh, that was a good one. <laughs> I like the music switch up too. Alright. Oh, he actually has a Florges. Okay. Is he gonna have a Florges and a Vicavolt? Yes. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh my god! Dude. Dude. That has to be the best shiny I've seen. Shiny Metacham is probably the best I've seen, dude. That looks so good. Oh my god. Why Metacham of all Pokemon to have such a good a good custom shiny? That's so cool. Wow. Your mind is open. You have shown master class in the way of the mind. You gained access to the top. the other side. I am worthless. I cheated. Wow. Welcome. I am Sage Alma. Congratulations on completing the Gauntlet of the Mind. However, you have one final test. The Trial of the Mind rewards the Master with a powerful Mega Stone of an ancient Pokemon of Realtra. Medicham has been a true symbol of mastery over one's mind for this dojo. The old sages would allow only the worthy to use the stone of Metacham. To complete your mastery test, you must beat me in battle. Be warned, this will not be easy. Begin. So our, our reward is a mega stone for Metacham. That's pretty cool. So I wonder... If you'd get a different Mega Stone if you chose the uh, the other path, I kind of want to try it out. Oh, he's level fifty, by the way. And that indeed he had Mystical Fire. Yeah, that's fair. Did not expect that. He only has four Mons, though. This thing might have a ground attack. I'm going to predict a ground attack. Bone Rush? No, Flash Cannon. What? Oh, my God. I'm not even fully healed, either. Like, I'm out of uh, I don't have any more Pyro Balls for Cinderace, I don't think. Yeah, let's go for double kick then. 
Is that enough to knock it out? It is. Let's go. Huge. Here comes Gallade. Go for Headbutt. Oh, good flinch. Huge flinch. Okay, never mind. <laughs> um... Knock off. Okay, that's fine. I thought it was going to go for a fighting attack. We're good. And this is definitely going to be Mega Metacham, right? Yep. Mega Metacham's faster than me? Interesting. I didn't know that. Alright, can I survive a hit and knock it with Dazzling Gleam? Oh, he missed a high jump kick! Well, that works out. Awesome. Perfect. Your mind. It's phenomenal. I see. Now I see the skill used to defeat all my students. You've made yourself worthy of this Megastone. Fantastic. Will I use Mega Metacham? Uh, maybe. I need to find a, uh, I need to find a Metacham first. So I'm assuming we can only get one or the other, right? Like, since we chose the mind, we can no longer go the other direction? Yeah, we can. Okay. I mean, we can walk, we could go up this path, but nothing's going to happen. I wonder, uh, I wonder what, uh, what other Megastone we could have gotten. Like, I'm trying to think, like, Lucario, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, let's, uh, let's move on from that. Let's head towards the, uh, the Pokemon Tower. Why must the world be so cruel? Mudbray, why did you leave me? Ah, hello. Have you come to pay respects to some of the fallen Pokemon here? Some Pokemon here mostly died of, of old age, but others... Let's just say, there are some, there are some terrible people in this world. I always come here to pay respects to my old pal, Drampa. I miss him. Got a spell tag. Makes sense. TM38 Will-O-Wisp. That's really good. As a breeder, it's sad to see so many dead Pokemon. Just tells me that people don't always take good care of them. I feel so empty now. Fullpix was so close to me. Machamp, where are you? Oh man. I come here every day to clean the tombstones and help keep this place clean for all visitors. I must say, it's a hard job. Are these the cauldron witches? The ghost will stop you.
probably, uh, should probably have muck out front to deal with these ghosts. What is a heathen doing here? Gower Geist. Well, you transformed me into a ghost? Huh. Okay, I'm taking a lot of damage from this curse. How much damage does curse do? Is it like one sixth or one fourth? Because I was doing, I was taking a lot of damage. You're not supposed to be here. Oh no, dude. Why? Why the destiny bond? Oh god. Well, that was annoying. Are you with Ace? First the black-haired girl, and now you. Miss Magius and Baynat. Your efforts are futile. Well, everyone's here. What is this? Why is there a P wait? Why is there a PC here? What? Wait. <laughs> wait. Why is there a PC in the Pokemon Tower? Uh, uh, okay. Did not expect that. Might have a battle coming up, so let me get prepared for that. You're too late, Ace. Rika has already shared our holy ritual. She has officially become one of us. 
One of us. One of us. One of us. Rika, get up and let's go. Ace, didn't you hear them? I'm not going back to that town. I'd rather just stay here with these people. Again with this. You got a town to look after. You don't have time to be sitting here playing witch when they need you. These ladies just kill Pokemon as they see fit, and you being here allows them to keep doing it. If you don't want to be a gym leader anymore, quit right now. But I won't let you use your position to just mess around. Yeah, of course. Care more about your rep as a gym leader. And all you care about is yourself. <laughs> Who even are you? <laughs> Who I am doesn't matter. You're a gym leader. You're being kind of selfish right now. <laughs> One of us. <laughs> One of us. One of us. Can you guys shut up? Rika, these people came here to help me bring you back. The townspeople are breaking their necks just to help you. And you think you could just use your gym leader status to chill with some psychos? The townspeople care more about my status than me. They're just worried they're going to lose another gym leader. This town is up here in the middle of nowhere. When I asked when I asked to be a gym leader, this is the last thing I wanted. What sort of impact can I have up here? Just let me stay here. Can't let that happen. You know that. Well, Ace, you heard her. Ladies, take out these heathens. <laughs> One of us. One of us. One of us! What are you doing? Wait, Ace, you can't take them on you can't take them all on alone. Watch me. Ooh, he is an incineroar. Rika, final warning. I'm not gonna hold back against people who hurt Pokemon. If you wanna stay, you'll get it all the same. I'm not messing around, Rika. Fine, I'll move. But you're not convincing me to go back to that town. We'll worry about that later. Now. Who's first? Rika, how could you do this to us? Destroy them! Don't let them leave here with our sponsor. Okay. So we get to take on two of them. Dusknor and Kafagrigus. Let's go Pyroball and Fly. If you guys are done, I think we'll take our leave. Don't let me see you guys around Rika again. Otherwise, it won't only be Incineroar. Let's go. Wow. 
Those two have some history. Maybe we shouldn't have come. It seems like Ace could have handled it on his own. I hope we can convince Rika to come back to the gym. Otherwise, you're sort of screwed when it comes to this specific gym badge. I might have an idea. Let's go see what Rika wants to do. Hmm. Okay. Oh, there's a TM here. What? Finally. Exactly what I was waiting for. Who? Oh, it's Lester. Don't tell me I have to battle again. My team's not healed. Look how easy it was to track you down. You really thought we were just going to let you go around getting in our way? You think you're the first to try to stand against us? Against me? You're just another low-life trainer in this region who thinks they can change everything. But soon, no one will even care about you. Since you want to get in our way so much, I'll just put you and your friends down. Something I should have done the first time I saw you in that forest. Fake wannabe heroes like you need a reality check. And I get to be the one to do it. Time... I didn't, I didn't get to read that. I think he said time to put an end to this. Is my team healed or no? They are. Okay. That's a good thing at least. Oh my god. I should have expected... I should have quick attacked because I should have expected Aqua Jet there. That was unfortunate. Shiny Houndoom. It's going to go for a fire attack. Mega Houndoom. Okay. You didn't go for a fire attack either. That is unfortunate. Speed boost. Is that what, nor what Houndoom normally has as a Mega? I didn't know that, if that's the case. He's going to heal. Yep. Gyarados. Probably should have went for recover, honestly. Oh, we got the boost! Let's go! That's huge. I'm going to recover. No, it has Power Whip. I didn't expect Power Whip. I didn't even know Gyarados could learn Power Whip. It's kind of crazy. Okay, um... Please tell me my Star Raptor is faster. Oh, it went for Dragon Dance. That's fine, though. You gonna Dragon Dance again? Please knock it out. Thank you. That could have gotten. That, that could have went very bad. Toxtricity. I'm not faster than Toxtricity, right? I think Toxtricity is very fast. Um. Leaveny can take an electric attack, but it can't take a poison attack. Oh, I'm faster than Toxtricity? I didn't expect that. I thought it would have been 100% faster than me. How fast is Toxtricity? Hold on. I need to see if my Leaveny is faster than I thought Toxtricity was, like, really fast. Uh, it's not fast at all. Wow, that is surprising. That is very surprising. It's only 75 base speed. Wow. I don't think I go to leave any, though, because am I going to do enough damage to knock it is the question. This is very risky. He's at low health. He might even heal here. He did heal, dude. I should have expected that. 
Oh, that was a crit. Okay. If that was non-crit damage, I would have felt safer. Oh, the boot. That is... So you got a critical hit! I think we just lose here. You hypered, which, which allows me to get off a of light screen, but I can't do any damage. My two mons left do not very effective damage against Toxtricity. Wait, it's only going for Boom Burst. Is this, uh... Hmm... Nice. How many does he have left? All we have is leave and he gets two. That's a cool shiny. Yeah, we lost. That is unfortunate, dude. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, I mean, we'll just come back and do a rematch, I guess. That's, that's very unfortunate. Oh, he missed. Well, that works out. That's four times effective. Oh, he had a berry. Okay, that makes more sense. There we go. What? What? How did I? How did I? Even with all the... No. Venom's gonna... No, I just... You've just made... The single worst mistake of your whole 
life. You'll pay. Oh, he dropped a Mega Stone. There's a small note on this Pokeball. Test number 153, Houndoom Z. S speed Boost. Use on a special... Use on specially bred Houndoom Z for speed boost effects. One time use only. What? It's a normal Houndoomanite. Okay, so Houndoom doesn't normally get speed boost as an ability when it's mega But they made... They made one that does. Huh. Interesting. We also get the TM for Phantom Force. Okay, very cool. Mark. What happened? You were in there for so long. Any witches stop you on the way out? Lester? The guy with the freaky hair? How did he know where you were? Damn it. I wish I was there to help. The whole time I thought you were right behind me. Did he drop any important information? Venom. That's probably that V guy they kept mentioning. That's huge, is what I would say, but we don't really know what to do with that. Maybe we can ask Ace and Rico, but they're dealing with their own stuff right now. Let's go and talk to them. They're down this way. Well, at this point we've kind of beaten all the, uh, all the Team Blight admins. We've beaten Xyla, we've beaten Hyde, and now we've beaten Lester. Rika, I'm not coming back here again to tell you the same stuff. You either quit being a gym leader, or you start taking your gym leader duties seriously. Why'd I have to be stationed so far away from society? It makes me feel like an outcast. When I applied to become a gym leader, I did it because I wanted to do some change. I can't do a thing up here. Not to mention the townspeople care more about my position. There's just nothing going for me up here. Well, how about starting up here then? Again, who? Scarlet, by the way. This is Mark. The people in town are a bit weird, but they do seem to have a good heart. Why not start doing some change up here? And how do you propose I do that? You're the gym leader. The town was excited to welcome a new gym leader, but they can't even spend time with you. Change has to start somewhere. At least get to know them first. They only want a gym leader. They don't care who it is. Well, you haven't even talked to them yet. Like, at least the first thing I did was talk to the Electiviers before fighting them. The Electiviers? There you have it, Rika. People are sticking their neck out, trying to help you. But you're only worrying about yourself. You're crying every day about having to live in Galanthus Town. But what about other people? You won't always get to live in your dream utopia. And part of the job is playing with what you're dealt. There are kids who have it far worse than you, who won't ever see happiness. Even the monks at the dojo know that. It's time to wake up and make a decision, Rika. Are you going to help your town or abandon them? I realize I was being a bit stubborn. The townspeople are looking for a new leader and I should at least get to know them before writing them off. Also, I was the one who wanted to be a gym leader in the first place. 
So even if I didn't get what I want, I won't get it acting like this. Glad you can come to an understanding. <laughs> okay. I guess you can say that, yes. Good to hear. Now let's head back. I don't want you catching a cold out here. You should be more worried about yourself. Where's your shirt? <laughs> How does he not get cold? Anyway, I'm glad we were able to come to terms with Rika. Let's hope she actually puts an effort, though. Also, Ace is a lot more mature than he lets on than he let on at first. Guy probably needs to lay off the excessive cursing, though. I think we did a good job today, Mark. We got another name that we can ask around about. Hopefully, Ace and Rika are able to give a bit of info if they have some. In the meantime, let's head back. Your Pokemon are probably tired. Rika, you're back. We were so worried. Um, I've been a little rude since I've came to this town. Come now, say it with some fire in your chest. Shut up, Ace. I want to apologize for my behavior before. I just wasn't too thrilled about being a gym leader in, in a town that's so secluded. I was being stubborn. Neglecting my duty as a as a leader isn't the right way to do to do anything. You all tried to make an effort to get to know me, and I pushed you all away. For that, I'm sorry. Rika, all we ever wanted was for you to be happy here. The last gym leader we had couldn't handle the cold and left. It's our job as a town to welcome and accommodate new members. Rest assured, I will give my best effort to be a good leader for this town. The location shouldn't dissuade me from doing what I set out to do from the start. I should have been taking this job seriously from the start. Hopefully, through us all working together, I can come to see what it is you all like I thought it was going to continue. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. We're all looking forward to working with you, Rika. And I'm looking forward to working with all of you. Okay. Good thing I didn't need to bring the rest of my team. Fighting off some witches. Getting to shit talk my old teachers again. Been a pretty productive day, wouldn't you say? What about your own gym? Should you really be out here this long? I got some people to look after the place while I'm gone. Again, sorry to make you come out here, Ace. And thank you two for your patience with me. Especially you, Scarlet. Your words really changed my perspective on this whole ordeal. I just... I have a little bit of experience dealing with people. Well, can I rely on you for advice? I feel like I might really need it. We can exchange phone numbers if you want. I'll come by to check out your progress from time to time. See if you've stopped being a little... <laughs> I get it, Ace. Good. My gym is going to be open to any and all challengers now. I'm probably not as strong as Ace, but I can promise you a challenging battle. I'll take it on. Would be a good way to see where I stand compared to a gym leader other than my sister. Your sister? Your sister's a gym leader? Yeah, Lena. Lena, huh? Haven't talked to her in a while. Yeah. That reminds me. Do you guys happen to know anything about someone named Venom? Uh, hello? Did you hear me? You've been running into Team Blight? Quite a lot, actually. According to Mark. Ace, 
It's fine. Relax. All we know is that he's the leader of Team Blight. Every gym leader on the East has been aware of them and him for a while. We've been doing what we can to keep kids safe. But aside from that, we've just been trying to increase our security. More reasons why we need strong trainers and leaders today. Huh. Guess where... Guess we were behind the curve on his name. Anything you can say about him? Like, did you know him personally? Not too much I can say about him. Don't really know him. I'm in the same boat. Sorry. That's fine. I gotta head back to Falugia. Hoping to see you guys there. Haven't had a good challenge in a while, so I'm looking forward to the visit. Keep eyes peeled for Team Blight. Peace. I hope you two prepare well for my gym. I'm gonna go ahead and prepare. Please give it your all. I'm looking forward to a good battle. Guess we gotta do some more digging on Venom. Splitting up is getting kinda dangerous though. If Team Blight has an easy time finding us, then they shouldn't have an easy time beating us. But all the while, we need to do what we can to save Dory. I'm going to do some training and thinking. After battling Rika, I'm going to head to Falugia as soon as I can. I'll see you later. Uh... Oh my god! Celebi? Is that... Okay then, well, interesting. What, Faye? Glad I'm finally out of that cave. Oh, what's going on, Mark? I got here pretty late, didn't I? I saw a bunch of people gathered around earlier but I really needed to heal my Pokemon. Lena was a really tough battle. Del is really struggling with her. I had to catch a new partner and train up really hard. I'm so ready to battle you again, but not right now. Scarlet told me everything earlier. I'm really glad she's a part of the squad now. Hopefully, I'll have more adventures with her instead of being so far behind. Dell's going to be lagging behind as well. Lena's really hard to deal with, considering his team is really weak to fairy types. I heard Rika's the gym leader here, so I'm going to train really hard. I want to go challenge the dojo, so I'll do that before taking her on. See you around. Okay. All right, do we need to train before taking on Lena, or not Lena, uh, Rika? Not really, our team's already at the level cap, so I think we just go for it. Yeah, we'll just go for it. Okay, so it is an ice gym. Hello. I'm starting to wonder if you only talk to me because I give you items. Hey, an Ultra Potion. Rika's a pretty new gym leader, so I don't know much about her battle style. But what I can say is that she's taking battles very seriously. She and my sister used to go to the same school. Oh, did I say something? Anyway, getting to change the weather will be very crucial against her. If you're able to take control of the battlefield, her Pokemon should falter a bit. Start showing what you're made of, Mark. It's do or die time. Okay, um... 
Oh man, maybe I should change my team for this. It's an Ice Gym, so Levany and Star Raptor might not be the best decisions to bring along. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go change my team. I did catch a Heracross. And we have the Mega Stone for Heracross, for Heracross so uh, we could get Mega Heracross. Yeah, you know what? I know exactly the two mons we're going to bring. I probably need to train him up, though, so I'm going to go do that. Okay, we're ready. Hello there, Mark. Welcome to the Galanthus Town Gym. Thanks to you, Scarlet and Ace, I was able to understand the kind of leader I need to be for this town. Acting the way I did, in a world where families and children need help more than ever, was just selfish thinking. I chose to be a gym leader, and a gym leader I will be. So come, Mark. I will use this challenge as a test of my growth as a person, and as a test of my growth with my Pokemon. So please don't hold back. I'd really like to see how you'll fare against my Ice-type Pokemon. Okay. Oh, it's a double battle. All right. What? Oh, that's not good. I've been frozen three times. Dang it. I was hoping we'd survive that.
Okay, I think there's one left. Wait, is this gonna be Mega Frostlass? It is Mega Frostlass. Oh, wow. That looks pretty cool. Can't really see all of it because the, uh, the Aurorus is in the way, but... Oh, now the Aurorus is gone. Oh, yeah, dude. That looks sick. All right, we win. I was a little worried at first because we got frozen three times early on in this battle. Wow. Well, congratulations, Mark. You've bested me in battle and have earned yourself the Galanthus Town Gym Badge. The Glacies Badge. With that badge, your Pokemon can now use Fly Outside of Battle, and can now level up until level 50. Also, I have two gifts for you. For beating the Gym Challenge, I'll give you this TM. TM27 Icy Wind. Alright. And this is personally from me. Frost Last Sight. Okay. Don't worry, I have another for myself. You're strong, so I can trust you. So I can trust you to use that to its fullest potential. Dealing with Team Blight is much more than I've ever dealt with. But soon, I do fear that they'll become a region wide problem. When that comes, I hope you'll be one of the trainers to stand against them. Okay. Here we go. North Route K. You ready? My tunes will shock your world. I missed, okay. By analyzing your team and my own, 
I have determined that you statistically stand no chance against me in battle. Quit now while you have the chance. Wow. Just in case you're wondering, Felugia Town is farther up. I'll give you this to help you out. One Max Repel. Thank you. Come on, kid. Pay up. I don't have all day. I already told you. I'll pay you once. What the? You're here too? Oh. Hey. So not only do you owe me money already, you distracted me and let the other guy get away. Wasn't me helping you on the island enough? But now that you're here, where's my cash at? Oh, okay, we're just gonna start battling. All right. Snorlax. I really wish we had a better move than double kick. That does nothing. I got a crit. Figgy Berry. Great. Good thing I changed uh, typing. Yeah, that's not good. Um, hmm. I knew he was going to heal, dude. That's really not good. Oh, good crit. I don't think another double kick is enough. It's not enough. Oh, dude, so close. Dang it. It's probably going to heal again. I don't know who to go into, though. We have to go into a special attacker. Okay, if he uses all his healing items now, that's great. Recycled, get back the figgy. Oh, that's not good. I'm going to use Ancient Power to try to get the boost. We got the boost. That's huge. Let's recover. I'm just going to use all my ancient powers to try to boost Gastrodon as much as possible. Let's see if it works. 
so far I only got one. And we're only going to get one. Great. I was hoping for at least two. Okay, we gotta go. We're also very under leveled. That Bray Loom is level 48. Wow, okay. Either that Bray Loom has skill link or it got very lucky. What? Dude. Okay. Just sacked off his S Cavalier. Crocodile. Am I faster than Crocodile? I don't know. I also don't know what it's going to do. Probably I'll go for a dark attack. It's going to Sylveon. We went for superpower. Oh, that's fine. That's okay. Take this time to set up my screens. Oh, wow. Three turns and it was unable to attack. That's very lucky. Okay, we're in a good spot. We got our screens up. Ambi Palm. Good crit. Oh, dude. The Q charm. It is coming in clutch right now. Okay, so all he's all he's left is the Bray Loom and something else. Oh, that's that is a lot. Oh wow. It's fine. It's fine. As long as we don't miss, we'll be good. If we miss, this will be bad. Okay. All right, one left. What is it? Sableye. Mega Sableye. Okay. Okay, we win. This is so lame. Man, where did you even come from? This is so annoying. 
You're lucky you're friends with Rose. Otherwise, I'd be hounding you for my money constantly. I'm trying to run a business here, and I can't just let people walk away without paying me. I have a life too, you know. Anyway, I can't waste my time here. I need to put in double the amount of work to make up for yet another kid running off with my stuff. Really gotta stop letting people hold the merchandise. Anyway, watch your back. I'm out. That was Marshall just now, right? Knew I recognized the bandana. My sister used to be pretty close with him. Can't believe the police really thought the kidnappings were on him. Swear, those guys are so stupid. Let me heal your Pokemon for you. Oh, thank you. Anyway, I was gonna come look for you. Ran into some Blight Grunts. But when I was about to listen in, they teleported away. I did hear something about them gathering in Felugia Forest, though. Whatever they're doing, we can show up there and surprise them. We're strong enough to handle their admins now. So whoever it is, I'm not letting them leave without getting some info out of them. I was thinking about asking Ace for assistance. He might be too busy, though. This route isn't too long. Lots of trainers, though, so be ready. I'll see you in Felugia. Alright, well, at least we got our team healed. That's good. 